All right, so this is the uh, lacrosse uh, easy goal purchased on Amazon. I will put a link in the description below. Um, this is uh, it's totally unboxed. There's a bunch of white netting. Uh, there's black three, uh, one, two, three, four, five pieces of the uh, black um, string. That's all the hardware they give you, which is not much at all. Remember, it's because there's a lot of these snaps already in here. So there's what appears to be um, five of the bigger poles. Got two of these little bendy get bendy ones here. These are the bottom braces. That's where the folding part takes place. And then two of these. Um, the whole list of parts are right here on the front. This is a really good diagram. I mean, it's not that difficult to figure this out. Um, when you flip it over in the instructions, this is the part I think um, I'll show you guys uh, in a few minutes on this video that can be, I guess, not uh, the most easy to figure out from the diagram, but it's this piece right here that um, they're pointing at right there. Um, and then there's another piece right here. So that is what they're describing as the big slot. So that's the big slot, as it says here, left back side, it's labeled. These obviously snap in there. I'm not gonna bore you with snapping them all in. Um, I'm gonna get the frame uh, set up and then I will show you how to put the netting on. Um, again, they do a pretty decent job of describing it in the um, visual and the instructions. So lace every third box on the straight sections and lace every other box in the corners. And then here it says leave about eight inches of rope on this tie off here. Um, and that's per the uh, folding part, so it has a little bit of, of extra give to, uh, to be able to fold back. Alright, so here's the uh, final assembly. The middle of the video got messed up. Um, so a couple adjustments and recommendations I would make. So the, the string that it comes with, it tells you if it's, um, I believe if I remember correctly, they wanted you to do the top every one, <clears throat> and then down here every third one. And I did that and I took a lacrosse ball and they easily could have fit through those gaps. So what I did is I put every single, as you can see here, every square, I intersected the twine. Um, and I actually had to go and purchase more. So I went to home improvement store. I think it was like $4. Um, I made it basically all the way to the top and then down the side. So I was missing more or less this uh, V in the back. Um, but anyway, I thought that worked better. And then the other thing I did, I'll show you, is I put some uh, zip ties kind of halfway through. I put some around the corners. Um, I put some down here. I need to cut that one off. And then you can see how I did it every rung here. And then I put a few in the back as well. Um, as you can see, there's a little bit of a um, sag here. Um, that's supposed to be that way. You can see the net fits perfectly around the frame. Again, the frame is not rocket science at all. Um, you can see the little, I'll call it a U, with the two little um, brackets that come out. Here's the other one connecting to that. And then there's the cotter pin that connects to the back if you want to fold it. Um, I'm probably never going to fold this one. So if you are going to fold yours, just make sure you install this piece correctly. So that pin pulls out of the back and then that bolt isn't like um, completely tightened, I don't know how else to say it. Um, it's loose enough to where it can shift and then and then this whole back will fold up. So um, here again, this is what it looks like. Hope that helps. It's not difficult. Um, you can probably, I can clean this up a little bit, but it's very well built.